Let's move on to the next question. So here we have to find the set of values of k for which the line intersects the curve y equal to this at two distinct points. Now, whenever we have two distinct points, we realize we have to use what? b square minus 4ac had to be more than 0. Okay? So let's first solve these two equations. We have a line, equation number 1, and the curve, equation number 2, intersects, so we have to solve them simultaneously. So here we have y already. We're placing this y, you will have kx minus 4 e is equal to x squared minus 2x. Send everything to one side, you will have x squared minus 2x minus kx plus 4 e is equal to 0. Simplify x squared. Now we, we can take out the value of minus, uh, so our value of x you will have plus minus 2 minus k times x. So x will be factorized outside and then we have plus 4 equal to 0. Then again we can still factorize. Take out minus you will have minus and then here you will have 2 plus this x plus 4. Okay so now we have this equation. We can uh, write down the values of this is a, this is b, and this is c. So b squared minus 4ac is what b squared is, this, b squared minus 4 times a times c has to be more than 0. Let's simplify. So first minus 1 squared is 1, okay you will have 2 plus k squared, that will be minus 16 more than 0. Now we can send this directly over here and solve, but let me just do this step by step so we're not confused. We have to expand this, what you will have? You will have 4 plus 4k plus k squared minus 16 more than 0. So you have k squared plus 4k, 4 minus 16 will be minus 12 more than 0. Now obviously we have to first find the critical values of k. That will be factorization. k times k, 12 is 6 times 2. To get plus 4, we need to have plus 6 minus 2. k have to be minus 6, and k have to be the value of 2. Now we just have to use the graph to find the value. So that will be the first value here is minus 6, and the value here will be 2. Now because the coefficient here is 1, it is positive, the shape will be something like this, right? We have to know this. Now here we have a 0, this will be 0. Now we need it to be more than 0 above this line, we need this to be above this line. So it will be on this side and on this side. So it means that k have to be minus 6, or k have to be more than 2. So this will be the set of values of k for which this is true.